Hey guys, it's Normac here. Got an unboxing for you guys. It's been rumored that it already released at GameStop before the release date of Tuesday, uh, January the 28th. But today is January the 24th, and I'm gonna unbox it today. I'm pretty freaking excited. I loved this game when I played it back on the PS3 when I beat it two times in a row. It was like back to back because it was just that good. Um, got it for the PS4 and it's just going to be just as good but even better with 60 frames per second 1080p and being able to take advantage of the features of the PlayStation 4 using live stream remote play and much more and all the downloaded contents on, on this game this game I'm talking about is Tomb Raider Definitive Edition this is also available on the Xbox One but it seems like um, this is the better version as um, far as when it comes to frame rate per second. This is 60. Uh, at the mo moment, it's still rumored to be 30 on the Xbox One. I have no idea, but I was getting it for the PS4 no matter what anyway. Uh, I use remote play so I can play on my Vita if I wanted to. And uh, stuff along the lines of that, I know Xbox One version can use the Kinect camera. I'm not sure if this makes use of the PlayStation camera, but I'll find out when I play. But let's go and get this unboxed. Alright, here it is right here, Tomb Raider Definitive Edition for the PlayStation 4. Um, this is actually the pre-order edition. Uh, with that being said, that means it comes with the art book. If you did not pre-order the game, you do not get that art book. You just get the normal casing that you would get on any other normal game. But as you see here, it has one over 40 or just 40 E3 awards from Squ Square Enix and Qu Crystal Dynamics. It is a red and for mature game. But let's go ahead and look at the back real quick. Um, Let's see here. So, um, a obsessively detailed Lara, a stunning lifelike world, and a definitive edition of the critically acclaimed action adventure. Also on the side here, overcome uh, uh, grueling environments to survive Lara's first adventure. Endure high uh, octane combat. Never heard of that word before. Whatever. And customized weapon and gear. And like I said, it does come with the art books. It, it is exclusive with this, and it's never before seen uh, concept art. So that is pretty neat. But far as when it comes to networking and stuff like that, let's see, I'm trying to make sure you guys see it well. I can't get it. All right, so one player uses remote play. It is 16.5 gigabytes of uh, memory space. Online play is optional. Goes up to eight players online, two to eight. 1080p output and it uses the DualShock 4 controller and the reason why it is rated M let's see how can I do that alright there it is blood and gore drug reference intense violence and strong language um, so yeah let's go ahead and get this out of its cage guess we'll just do it from here but when I do unboxing videos, um, they're actually just going to be unboxings. Um, I used to do unboxing slash gameplays, which I include the gameplay inside uh, in, with the unboxing video. Um, I do like that idea. Maybe that's something I'll introduce in the future. Um, I might just do that for Vita games that I unbox. But as of right now, um, for the moment of my channel and everything, I'm just going to do straight unboxings. So they could be as long as this. And... Um, yeah, and I can kind of just kind of go more into detail when it comes to rating and what it's all about. But here's the disc right here, the Blu-ray disc of Tomb Raider Definitive Edition for the PS4. Let's kind of have a quick look at this uh, art book. We won't go through page by page, but we'll look at a few. Alright, looking nice, looking nice. Yeah, we could probably skim through the whole thing real quick. I don't see a big deal. just want you guys to get a good look of what you're able to get if you did pre-order. Um, if you did pre-order at any other stores or even online, um, you're more likely to get this edition, so you still have time if you don't want to go pick up your copy at GameStop right now. As of the 24th, you are able to go pick it up if you pre-ordered right now. Um, if you did not pre-order, there's going to be very limited copies available, and it is likely that they're gone because I did not pre-order a copy, and they only got two extras in, and I was actually lucky enough to get this uh, special edition because I'm actually really um, good with the people at the GameStop there. Um, I've been going there for years, and they know me very well. Um, I was there actively over the holiday season, getting PS4, Xbox One games, accessories. I was all about that over um, the 2013 holiday season. So they recognize my face, they know my reputation, and 
that's what uh, I get um, being a good uh, gamer, I guess you could say. Anyway, that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed the unboxing. Leave me some thoughts and comments and feedback down below in the um, bottom area, uh, comments area. Um, yeah, so just tell me what you guys think of the game, of course. Um, if you guys have it, if you guys don't, if you guys have any questions, if you guys have any requests, just let me know. When I say request, that could go for uh, just simple gameplay, like the multiplayer, for example. Um, maybe clips of the game itself. I'm actually planning to do a playthrough, so you guys can look out for that very soon. Um, they'll probably release slowly, but I'm going to try to release them as soon as I can. Highest quality I can, very detailed when it comes to tags and descriptions, so I can get those viewers and uh, the satisfaction of your eyes to view this uh, video game so um but other than that just thanks for your support it really means a lot guys thanks for watching and i will chat with you guys later normac out